Caps, this is Mikey Cap Productions, and it's really early in the morning, guys. It's about like almost 6 30 in the morning because, um, we're about to be going crabbing. And because uh, the reason we're going early is because, um, uh, it's gonna be high tide, and we want to at least go because it's gonna be high tide. But, um, we're just gonna make our best and do a good job, maybe catching crabs. Yeah, we're just getting ready, guys, and, um, uh, we'll maybe we'll see you maybe in a little bit, probably. I mean, we'll see. So, yep. Yeah. All right. Hey guys, we just made it to the bay right here, and it's, it's about like um. Let's let me check what time it is. Uh, it is um on my phone 7:35, guys, and we got here a decent time as long as it's low tide. So here's the water right here, right behind me, and let me turn the camera around for one second. We got a cage right here for the catch crabs. I'm guessing that's what it's for. So what else could it be for? And the fishing rod we're gonna use. We're gonna use it to catch fish. And yeah, that's for you, Sal. Yes, it is. Oh, we got we got more right here. All right. And we got those things. I'm guessing that's for the catch. Maybe fish. Maybe. I think that's what it's for. And and right here we we got some food for for the fish. I think. And we're gonna use that uh, as bait, I think. Maybe yeah, we're just putting the string right here. So how do you know we got one? Pull it up over oh, that's smart. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Dad, I think there's one. Dad, I want to check the trap. Let's get that. Yeah. Oh, we oh, we found one. We got one. We got one. Yeah, oh, look at him. Don't touch. I got nothing to do with yeah, it's going to bite you. It's going to bite you, it's Sal. Bit, it'll get you, Sal. <laughs> it'll pinch you. <laughs> but I'm fine now. Now I'm left. At all times, you must hold the rod. Yeah, look, hey, look at it, guys. Look at it. I want to pick up. Good start. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> There's more food over here. Okay. Don't try to snap out of Fishing rods. Uh, Nicole got a crab. Oh, uh, what did that? Oh, Darius. Darius got a fish. Touch it, touch it. Touch it, Sal. It might be me. What kind of fish is that? I don't know. It looks like. Yeah, I'm wondering the same thing. Teeth. This looks like a little baby bull shark. It looks like a bull shark guppy. Oh, there he is. never touch a fish. You got that right. Never touch a fish. Yeah? Oh wow. So I can take them, right? Right. I can, I can grab the hook like this. Mm hmm And then do that and you shake some. Really? Yeah, and I never have to touch the fish. Oh, alright. He's gotta go. No. He's gotta go. He can't, he can't keep him. It's too little. He's getting so little. Is that, is that the rules? Yeah. yeah. I didn't know that. See, I want, do I want to do it? Oh, 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 oh he committed suicide. <laughs> oh, Did he run out? Did he run out? Yeah. Oh. They think they hit each other. Your parents are somebody drowning or something? Um, two days ago. Oh, there you go. We got fish. Can we save them? Yeah. Are you serious? I can't yeah. get one. Here you go. We'll go and convince. It's a good idea to have. I'm just going to stand back. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You have reflexes like a cat, hun. You're a gazelle. You're like a oh, I'm scared. Oh! I got one! He's got it by his hand. There you go! I'll put it with the crab. Put it in the cup. Right now. Dude, what the f Should I put some ice on it? 
Oh, well, those are fish, guys. You know, guys, it's like a ruler right here. It's all uh, the uh, Yeah, it tells you what you can keep, what you can't keep. Uh, is that what it says? Well, there's certain sizes for certain fish. Yeah. Right. So they give it to you. Say it starts at the zero. So if you catch a fish and it's supposed to be seven inches, it gives you so you're able to measure it and then throw it back. Oh, okay. Do you have teeth? They yeah, look right there. Yeah. I'm just gonna uh, zoom in a little bit. I want to get him. I want this guy. Cats, I'll, I'll get this guy. That's how you can. That's how you can see a closer look. That, mommy, can you get that fish for me? Uh -uh. Really? No, oh, wait, okay. I want to show cats. All right. Monkey, the monkey got the mask. Let me get the mask. Yeah. Oh, were you promoting? It's like, oh, I wonder why it's a monkey cat. It's a monkey cat mask. It's the only reason I have it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> you won't even get me. Put, put the lid. Put, go like this. Go like this. Uh, okay. Oh, that's perfect. Look, he does a fight. You ever see one has the knives? Oh, I love it. Oh, what? <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. This crab has the two knives? No. Nice. It's like, oh, then that's he played music like West Side Story? Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've never seen one. Me and Vince did the crabs. We didn't know you had to put them on the... Oh, so we got one thing? Where's his other wing at? Get away. He lost his other claw. Who ate it? Who ate the claw? We can't even get a full crab. We can't even get a full crab. What about when they were coming at us in my father's kitchen? Yeah. We put them on ice. That's pushing it, too. I only had four and a half. It's four and a quarter. Is it? No. I put the cup on the cup. I'll get the cup. Don't worry. Why are you throwing it to the seagull? Oh, that's perfect. That's it. Wait, here it goes. Throw it. Throw it. Bye. Huh. All right. Look at it. Wait, why is he leaving? And he went down like the Titanic. He's dead. Here he comes right here. Wait, let me take a picture. Here, look yeah, at get me. ready to throw. So look, look at mine. All right, I'm just gonna stand right back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand up here. Here, throw, 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 throw. Watch. Uh, it went down too far. Oh. Huh. You just killed two, two of God's creatures for no reason. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> come on, girl, come on. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I don't know what it is. Yeah, Nicole, take that, Nicole. That's a bigger fish than we saw. <laughs> That's two nothing, Nicole. It's a guppy blue shark again. See, I'll give it a kiss, yeah. Oh my god! Hey. What the hell is that? Sea bass. A sea bass, that's oh, yeah. what it is. Yeah, there we go. Bye As long as he swims away, right? Yep. Yep, they have, this one has two claws and this one only has one claw. But I got... <laughs> All right, nice go. That's good. But look at this. <laughs> he's ready. He's ready. He's ready to bit my finger. Let's see, uh, oh, I don't know. Let me see. Ready? Yeah. You are. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Don't load it. He grabs the camera. Look, he's gear he's gearing. Look, <laughs> he's gonna grab the what's the name. You better watch. Wait, can I show the cap? <laughs> <laughs> I know, my name is Habina. Careful, Mom. He's like, bro. Look at that big fish, guys. That's big. Uncle Frankie just caught one. That's a big one. Wow, that's huge, man. Oh, look at that. Flop like a fish, that's right. No, like we gotta let it go now. Then. There, we're in pliers. Oh, come on, guys. It's feisty. Dude, this one has teeth. Sit out. I want him back. That's dinner. Huh? He's huge. No, he's not huge. We green crab, not. Now 
then there it goes. Yeah, it was huge, Sal. Look, guys, look what it says on the plane up there. It says support autism awareness. Thanks to Mike Seafood. Thank you, plane, for giving me that message. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Riley. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Hey. How old are you today? Hey, it's Riley's birthday today. She's turned three. Stop throwing. Please. Let me see. Oh, you're so beautiful. Hi, baby. Sal's here. We do. Yeah, let me just take a few chairs. I Riley, where are you, Mama? What are you doing? Oh, so beautiful. I love you, Mama. I love you, baby. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here. Your, your hair looks so pretty, Mama. Yes. What? Are you getting ready to go to Poppy's pool? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Do you have your baby shark? Yeah. Oh, you don't bring your shark? Why? Oh, Mom. Um, you why? It's for the pool. It's a water gun. Hey guys, we're back at the campground and um, uh, we're actually going to be having a cornhole tournament on the court right here, I think. Um, if if that. Yeah, no problem. All right. Yeah, we're having it right here on the pickleball court. So yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna help out Uncle Johnny with the boards. No problem. And yeah, we're gonna pretty much get started in a little bit. I think it starts at like one o'clock. Yeah. All right. And do you, how many people do you think are going to show up? Are, are we allowed like uh, Probably like 40, 50. 40? Okay, well, are we allowed that many? Yeah. Oh, all right. That's, uh, I'm, I'm, last time we were, we were at the lake, uh, they said only 25 people. Right. Yeah. Now they raise it now. Yeah, that's good. Well, we're just setting up with these lines I'm right there. put these here so nobody can place. All right. Hey, guys, we got a fan right here. Tell us your name. Maya. Maya. And um, I believe she was in my last year's vlog. So um, how was your winner? Actually, very weird. It like never snowed. Well, uh, the first of all, I think the March around when the pandemic started, we we kept we had to do like uh, wear a mask and social distancing. It was we were like in quarantine and we had to stay home with a lockdown, which kind of sucked. But um, but the downside is we can't we can't hug, we can't touch nobody, we can't shake hands. It, it's just um, uh, it's it's just sucks. But um, uh, I'm, I'm glad you were in my vlog again. So um, uh, you want to elbow it? All right, so um, I, I hope to see you again. All right, all right. And the pool's open. I'm pretty sure you see it in my last vlog. And um, people have to bring their own chairs if you didn't know. We're not allowed to have pool furniture this year. And people have to sign in from over here, and to get in the pool, it will be uh, like I don't know if it's 25 or 50 percent capacity, but um, just in case you didn't know where the pool furniture is, it's right under the pavilion. Just it's been there since it's winterized for the winter. Ever since the winter uh, was around, so yep, they're in there, guys. Hey, what's up, everybody? Hey, hey Nicole. How are you? Good. Long time no see. No, it's been forever. Yeah, uh, it was, last time we saw each other was like Memorial Day. Yeah, I think. So. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll give you a hug. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> and pound on it. Yeah. And what's up? What's up, man? Uh, yeah. And uh, what are you guys up to? Nothing much. Going to the village. village. You're going to the village? I see. Yeah. yeah. What are you doing? Uh, watching the cornhole tournament. If you guys want to come see it later. Uh, yeah, I'm we'll definitely yeah. coming. All right. All right. Yeah. I'll see you. All right. Have fun. Have fun. The village. Uh, save me something good. I got you. All right. And the reason why they close the pool time to time is because they have to clean it with two hours short uh, when people, new people, come in uh, and clean the pool, and they have to clean the pool, and um, for two hours. So, um, and then they open up again. So that makes sense, guys. It does. Uh, they have to close it and then do some stuff to it. 
Hey guys, I just wanted to tell you that um, I'm outside. The reason is uh, I do want to tell you guys something is that we may actually go get some pizza later on the boardwalk. So, um, uh, but I, uh, I don't think we're gonna, we're not going on. We're definitely not going to go on. I'm not going to go on any rides at least. But um, I know they're open. But um, it's just it's going to be only 50% capacity, and there's nah, might be too many people. And there, uh, I'll tell you the rules in a little bit. But first, first off, I want to tell you about um, the website that Maurice Pierce had. Yes, this is our website right here, guys, and park status, and there's attractions closers, and they say safety together, and I'm not going to read the whole thing, but um, it's closed due to several factors, including the work stoppage for over two months and shortened time frame to reopen. Currently, staffing levels, travel restrictions to overseas or contractors, or social distancing guidelines, just to name a few. And uh, Adventure Pier is the only pier that might be closed for the season, at least, but um. Uh, I think that's the reason, but um, Mariner's P Mariner's Landing, uh, uh, the, the attractions are Ghost Ship, Sir Sea Serpent, uh, the bumper cars, which is Super Scooters and Hinaki, and um, that's the only rides that are closed on that pier. And the, the, the all the rides that are listed right here, like the Great Nerissa, Doo Whopper, Dante's Dungeon, the Wacky Whip, Kanga Bounce, Zoom Flume, Cygnus X1, Rock and Roll, Tilt to World, Atmosphere Convoy, Kitty Train, and Howitzer. So only a couple, or the couple rides are open on that pier, including the Runaway Train, which is that's open. Raging Waters. Water Park is open at uh, 930 and Ocean Oasis, uh, that's not going to open this year, guys. These are some of the, the rides that are listed that are closed, so I hope you guys get it, and uh, that might not be the summer we all expected, but, um, yeah, it is what it is, guys, but we'll have to just play it by ear and all. All right, guys, since we just talked about Maurice Spears like uh, a couple hours ago for you guys uh, on an update, well, we're actually going right now to walk on the boardwalk for a little bit and then see some things that we haven't seen yet uh, since uh, the everything is starting to reopen. And um, it's little by little, guys, but um, it's starting to come to life down. People from our campground have already gotten Sam's Pizza, so we're actually going to get some curly fries instead. So uh, they're going to save me a piece. So save them. <laughs> yep, we're heading there now, guys. But um, I wanted to tell you that the Sea Serpent roller coaster ain't open. And the reason why is because, um, well, there was staff who were from another country, but then they they weren't allowed to go, come back until uh, the pandemic was all over. Is that true? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, look, guys, we got a new sign for Wildwood up there. And I, I, yeah, I seen it online. And but I wanted to show you. Look, and this is um right here on Rio Grande, and it says "Welcome to the Wildwoods." That looks that looks dynamite. <laughs> and oh, look, guys, we got something new over here too. It's some beach balls. And yeah, that's what it is. And it has an LED screen with events and stuff. It's saying Instagram and Facebook, all that. Yeah, you can see it. And look, there's more beach balls right there. And and all the way straight ahead is the big Wildwood sign. And I showed you guys that the summer, and I took a picture in front of it. And there are a lot of people down, uh, which uh, but still they still have to be s the social distancing rule. And there's the Starlux Mini Golf with the Coors Brothers stand. And at least uh, they opened golf uh, like a couple weeks ago, but. There's the wallet sign, guys. Yeah, I showed you, finally got to show you guys again. Yeah, with uh, some more beach balls. And there's beach balls everywhere on this uh, uh, street. Yeah, it's Rio Grande Avenue. I mean, what do you expect there to be? Yes, this golf course right there has like a beach theme and they also have an ocean theme and they also have a boardwalk theme and it's all like doo -woppy. So, yeah, that's the convention center right there. And has anyone even been inside it recently? Yeah. yeah. Have you went in there before? When I was a kid. When I was a kid, uh, what what they had in there? I think we went to see the Harlem Globetrotters, and I think I've seen wrestling in there. Before. Oh, I didn't. I never knew the Harlem Globetrotters had been around that long. Oh my God, it's forever. Oh yeah. Uh, I I went to saw, see them in 2018 with my special Olympics friend. An update, guys. Uh, there are some bad. One bad news is that Adventure Pier is the only pier that's not open. Uh, I don't even know if it's going to open this year. Uh, uh, we'll see, guys. But um. And Splash Tunes all the way straight ahead. And we're actually going to be going to Mar the Mariner's Pier because there are some interesting things I want to show you. Because the, I, well, you'll find out soon enough. I'm sure you've seen it online and everything. But I want to show you in person, whatever. Look, there's $30 to park here, guys. That's definitely outrageous. And uh, I think, I don't know if it's because of the coronavirus, but um, $25 to park, $25 to park right there. Yeah. And yeah, there's Splash Tunes, guys. And it is open. Uh, but people have to wear masks. Uh, I don't as long I don't know if I see any people wearing masks. I see a couple people wearing masks, but yeah. And oh, by the way, I want there's another fact, fun fact I want to share with you guys is that member Castle Dracula, that used to be right there. It used to be right around where the slides are. And Vince, uh, did you used to want to go on it? Uh, 
I go inside the castle, I will go in the boat ride. You well, there, there's two attractions, right? Yeah, of it. Two. There was like a, it was like a fun house type thing, and uh, scary ride. It was, it was scary. It was uh, with a uh, uh, vampire Dracula. Then they had. Um, that's what you sang. You did your action. the karaoke. Yep, uh, I bet you. I, it's on my channel, guys. So go check it out. Maybe I'll put the link uh, in the description or something. Uh, where I found out 2012 that I sang karaoke playing that funky music by Wild Cherry. Yep, that's one of my favorite songs back then. <laughs> All right, guys, we're heading on the boardwalk, and um, there's people around me. So yep, um, I got my mask on, so we should be able to just um, wear our masks and stay safe, guys. And the train car is running, guys, but there's actually protections uh, on it right here. So what does people stay safe? And yeah, every, uh, everything, most of the stuff is pretty much open. We got the, the aquarium, I think, is open. Oh, turtles! Oh, look, guys. Yeah. yeah, we're in the entrance of the aquarium. We got some turtles right here. They're like big tortoises. Yeah. Look, guys, <laughs> that's cute. Yeah. Look, there's four of them right here. And Old Time Photos is open with the, the 3D Mini Golf. Yeah, like I said, Lime Ricky's open, and um, and I, uh, some all the arcades and uh, parks are pretty much open except for Adventure Pier. But um, we got um, paintball right there, and um. This is the Mariners Arcade, which is open also, but um, there's like a little entrance right there you have to go for, guys, and you have to wait 25% capacity. And it's a little out here. Yeah, guys, there's a lot of people here. But we're safe, don't worry. And look. Look, this is the arcade right here. We can't go in. And the games are open, too. At the sound of the bell, you guys want to squeeze down on your triggers and aim for your target. Whoever gets their guy to the top first wins. In order to get into the spear, you have to pay uh, $7 to get in, and you have to wear a mask with, uh, in, in, in order to get in, guys. And this is the entrance, they changed up. And look, you have to be sure you use san hand sanitizer, and um, and this is the line that starts right here, guys. We got um, private property. Hey, look. The rides are open though, which is good. Look. We're zooming in, guys. Yeah, there you have it. That's one update of what we got right for you guys. Sorry we didn't go in the pier, but um, we have to follow the rules somehow. I mean, we, we don't want to spend money on going in the pier and uh, it's, it's just a lot of the times that we have to deal with, but um, we're I think we're actually gonna get curly fries right now. Oh, guys! And Mariner, Mariner's Pier is the only main pier with rides that are open, but um, on the surf side here, which is Mount Maury's Pier or whatever it's called, but um, it has like the runaway tram open, and they also have only like five rides open. So, surf side pier is not really uh, that much of the pier to go to right now, guys. But um, Mariner's Pier, if you want to go there, I mean, just wear a mask and you'll be good, at least go on rides. But well, I'm going to wait a little bit uh, until I go on some rides. That way I'm safe, guys. Oh, it looks so good, guys. Salty, nice. Uh, this is ours. Yes, it is. Yep, we got it. Thank you. The best time, the thing we got is curly fries, guys. And uh, like I said, we uh, there's already Sands Pizza at the campground because um, uh, my one of my cousins went went and get got it, and they're probably uh, there right now. And uh, this is Orange Aid right here. That's what Vince got. I'm gonna try it out. He's gonna let me try it out. So let's try. It. Uh, it tastes good, guys. And you should try the lemonade too. I never. I don't think I might have tried. I think I did try the lemonade. From Curly's before, but um, yeah. And, and, well, first of all, um, Vince went to go get some fudge on uh, for maybe for mom. I, I don't know, but mm, maybe to like some fudge, and we're gonna save them curly fries for her too. Mm. Yeah, guys, they're good. Really good. And we're trying to finish the rest of this curly fries right here, so it's good, guys. <laughs> and, and, and Buster's been barking for like the past five minutes. I don't know. I already took him for a walk twice, but um. I already took you, Buster. What more do you need, buddy? <laughs> um, now what? You want, the, you want the camera? Or, I don't know. 
But I, I took them out already, guys. But um, no, I want to finish the rest of my curly fries, and I'm I want to relax. So, all right, guys. Now um, this is we got fudge from the boardwalk. Uh, but uh, mom wanted some, but um, I might I want to try some out. So I I know it's it might be chocolate. Uh, is it chocolate? There's peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh, okay. Oh. So you have vanilla, and then you have chocolate, and then you have a peanut butter cup. Uh, Reese cups. Yep. Uh, Want to try that one? Yeah, sure. All right, guys. It definitely tastes like Reese's. It is good. I like it. You like it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. A little bit, but I want I want to try the maybe the, either the chocolate or the vanilla on one now. Mm -hmm. All right. Next, we're gonna try the vanilla. One, two, three. Hmm. Mm. It doesn't taste that bad. It's good, guys. Mm, let's uh, maybe I can try chocolate now, and maybe I can combine it. Let's. Mm. All right. Mm -mm. I'm gonna have to make sure I pick up crumbs since Buster don't eat them because it will not be good if you eat them. Mm. Ah, it tastes good, guys. I love. I think fudge is my one of my good favorite things now. Um, you should try it out. Um, uh, we may not get to go on rides. We may not get to play arcade games and all, but um, at least we got new things. But I got to try out new things, guys. No, we couldn't get into here because it was too crowded. So, yeah, we know we have to do what we got to do, guys. And I know sometimes you like to do it, but um, you have to follow the rules too. So yeah. And just got myself Sam's pizza and got from Aunt Tara's. And we're putting away now the pop box, and we got some more over here for tomorrow. And Sal's eating popcorn. And yep, that's pretty much it for tonight, guys. Yep. Buster doesn't. It's like refusing to go uh, use the bathroom, guys. And he's he's refusing to pee and all that. And because he, he thinks we're leaving without him. Look at him. Yeah, we're we're getting ready to leave soon, but um, he's just standing there. He 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 won't walk. Yeah, I tried doing it, but um, he won't. Who wouldn't walk without me, guys? It's everything all right, Buster? Cool. Look at him. Well, let me just jump over the lease. Oh. <laughs> he's just standing there. Oh, he's, oh he, okay, he's being. That's all I want. That's fine. All right, that was good. Oh, he's good now. Right. Hey, guys, we're back home now. And um, just to let you know, um, we're, we're just probably going to chill here. And I might be able to sign off now. So, um, But first off... Uh, before I do, um, I'm going to show you what we got, guys. We got new chairs for our fire pit. So maybe sometime in the future when we do another fire, we can just sit in the back and with these lights on and chill, guys. And that's what we might do tonight, but I'm probably not going to vlog it, though. Uh, we might be in the pool, but it's covered right now. But we're back home, guys. I wanted to tell you guys is that um, uh, Nikki Campson, I had a great time at his party, and I also had a great time crabbing, and I also went to Wildwood and showed you everything I could show you. And um, uh, maybe down the line, hopefully the if it numbers go down a little bit, hopefully uh, we can go back there and maybe possibly ride some rides again. But um, it might not be for a while, so I, we don't want anything bad to happen. So that's what it is. And mom is putting some stuff away she's cleaning up hi yep and um yeah we had a great weekend right mom it's fun it was fun i want to go fishing again yeah me too and um the, uh, uncle frankie caught the biggest fish i know the flounder the flounder just like from back. the little mermaid the yellow We're going one. Pool later, okay? all right we should have caught sebastian too the little lobster nah it's all right <laughs> but um we we couldn't find uh, any of the little mermaid characters but besides flounder <laughs> all right guys well that might be it. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give a like, subscribe if you're new to Mike Care Productions. If you want to see some information, if you like what I do, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And you can find me on Snapchat and I'm Mikey Cap. And also, check out, uh, if you still want to check out my friend Nikki Camps' video, I'll put the link in the description and check out his channel. So, you can check out his latest vlog he put up a couple weeks ago when we vlogged in Driftwood uh, way back. And um, yeah, that's pretty much takes it, guys. And Mikey Care Productions signing out. Until then, thanks for watching. Peace out, guys. Thank you.